Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Sly Cooper. In the previous episode, we did a little bit of tutorial stuff. We're probably still doing the tutorial, but um, I died a lot. So hopefully uh, this one will go a little bit better. Also, hopefully this episode will be a little bit longer than that one. Um, if not, I'm that sorry. That might be a good time to mention that hitting the X button twice will give you an extra high jump flip. That's what, that's what I'm doing. I didn't even realize we had a double jump, but I've been doing it the whole time. Okay, that was weird. That blimp looks like the most secured location on this boat. If Raleigh's really as smart as his police files suggest, then that's where I'll find him. Wonderful idea, but your plan is flawed. Why? Because it's impossible to get near him. To access Raleigh's blimp, you would have to sneak through that high voltage power tube. To do that without getting electrocuted, you'd have to destroy that power generator. And to do that, you'd need two more of Raleigh's treasure keys, which are heavily guarded. Interesting. So when are you going to get to the impossible part? Fine. But I warned you, I've marked the areas you need to hit with holographic markers. Follow them to your objectives. Thanks. Don't mention it. It's your funeral. <laughs> Okay, so the uh, the keys that we collected, or the one key that we collected in the last episode, still is useful for this. That's good. We get to have keys, like, or like they don't get used up after we use them. Wow, you found a lucky charm. That'll protect you when you take any damage. Oh, okay, so we can take one hit as I almost fall into the water. <laughs> It's like uh, Crash Bandicoot in that case. So yeah, he has no HP. He literally just cannot get hit. I see, chaps. My heart is congratulations to you all. The storm machine has sunk its 50th ship last night, and the loot has already been unloaded. Our operation is moving along splendidly. With the possible exception of I didn't know if he'd be saying anything important, that's why I was running around like a goofball. But uh, I do see that we now have this horseshoe thing on the back of our back, so let's go do this easy one first, and then we'll get the uh, the more difficult part afterwards. I think that's how we we roll this. Better close those furnace doors. Jump and press the square button. That'll slam them shut. Okay, we have a ground pound like move. Although it's not really ground pound, it's more of uh, just, I don't know what you would call that. It was like the ramp, red, the, the ramp? <laughs> the wrench uh, strike. Room. My analysis tells me that if you trace the spinning crankshaft all the way back to its source, you'll find Raleigh's treasure key and sabotage his machine while you're at it. Remember, Sly, hold down the circle button near the blue stealth auras to perform super sneaky thief moves. <laughs> super sneaky, you're super sneaky. <laughs> this game's gonna get so difficult later on. I can already tell just from like the first level and not knowing what I'm doing. That should be fun, right? I can't wait. We couldn't select a difficulty. It's one of those kinds of games because it was, came out early, early 2000s. So no difficulty selection here. We just gotta know what we like or what we're good at, or just be good at everything. Oh my goodness! I dropping the clues. I thought I could get them easily. Ooh, is that a free life? Ooh, okay, that's good to know. Can we break this? No. Okay, we'll just jump down. Can we go backwards and grab these? Oh, we can. They're not like lost forever. Wow. Music really making me feel like a spy right now. 
Uh, okay, I think we can make it through this. Oh, I see where they're slicing. I was wondering where you could actually tell where these things were hitting the ground. The raid right on these dark spots. Ah. We've used up all of our good. Oh, that was close. We used up all the good stuff. Like all of our little backup HP live things, hit markers. Ah. Horseshoes? Horseshoes, that's what they're called. <laughs> but also they're called they're like called something else for this kind of game. I'm not sure what the actual word it is though. Have I mentioned how smooth his movement is? I think I did last time, but it's very smooth and I like it a lot. Um uh, as that kind of thing happens, I don't know. Oh, we have less coins now? I guess they reset each level. And I didn't realize that before. I really don't know what they're going to be used for. If they're used for anything. But at least we know we don't have to collect every single coin. Oh no, doing this flawlessly is going to be so tricky. There we go, we finally made it. Just took a little bit of concentration, but we made it there finally. If I had fallen right there because I forgot to press circle on that thing, I would have lost it. Also, why are these enemies like take up the entire section where you can wa walk and run? Makes it much more challenging. Okay, this time we got some lasers. Oh, okay, they disappear after a little bit of time. Oh, jeez. We managed to make everything drop, so that's good. Trying our best to get as many of these things as possible. Don't know if we're actually going to get any of them, but it would be really nice to get at least one vault open at some point. Oh, come on, man. Please. Okay, we're back here again. We made it. And we died to him again. <laughs> no, that was it. That was game over. I have to go through that entire thing again. Wait, where's it start us from? Okay, it starts us from here. That's not too bad. Got past them, finally. Okay, we're in new territory now. Holy moly, that took forever. This game's gonna be so challenging. <laughs> I can already tell, like, I don't even know how to get past these guys. I thought maybe you had to go after their hammer slams down. And that seems to work the best for me most of the time, but then that happens. So, is it? Okay, let's try this again. As I was saying, I missed a bottle early on, so we're not even gonna get all the bottles in this level, but we might get close, maybe? Oh my goodness. It's okay, we have the horseshoe, we're okay, we can continue on forward. But now there's a fire-breathing beaver. Are these even beavers or are they gophers? Oh, did we make it to that checkpoint? Did that count? Th did that count as- Oh, we cheated the system, but we only have one life left. Oh, no, 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 no. It's okay, I live, I live for these uh, difficult games. It's been a while since we got to play something super challenging, right? Totally didn't have that issue in the last game that we played. <laughs> oh no. Uh, I guess I jump over from here? Oh, this is lava right next to us. That's a weird texture for lava, but I'll, I'll accept it. Ooh! Oh, it's a pipe that we can climb up, okay. I remember that they said that you could do that. Here's You're still this. jumping the gun. You need a few more clues. Well, I tried. I we're missing eight. I only saw one that we did miss that I didn't end up getting when we were running back here. Hmm. Very interesting. Uh. Okay. We gotta figure out what we're doing here. Is this a vault? You can't jump up on this furnace, Sly. You better go back and find an alternate route. Alternate route behind us. Ooh, there's an HP level up. Hey, level one up, one up. One up. Oh my goodness. Also, I'm sorry if I have uh, less energy again today. <laughs> I have another headache. I don't know where it came from. 
uh, but it's managed to hit me out of nowhere. It was I was fine for the first half of the first episode, and then just the second episode started, and I suddenly got a headache. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's, uh, I'd say it's lack of water, but I'm drinking the water, so I don't know. I think we gotta jump on top of this thing. Might just be the fact that we're playing a new game and my eyes aren't adjusted to it yet. But, um, this might be the last episode in this recording session, which is really weird because it's only two episodes. <laughs> uh, okay, so how do we get that one? How would you manage to do that? You, I think you get it and then you can, oh, we can come back, right? Because it's just dangling. Uh, tricky. Oh, whoa! What was that? Okay. That was <laughs> a really weird movement. <laughs> I'll try and have more energy next time. I'm s I promise, guys. I promise. We just gotta make it there. Uh, okay. This is... Oh, I see what we gotta do. We gotta close all these vents. This does not seem safe at all. Oh, I screwed it up. No, 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 no. I like that he loses his hat when he dies sometimes. That's pretty, that's a nice, that's pretty funny. It's a nice little detail, but it's also funny. Okay, this time we're gonna do this without dying. That's very cool. I do like these uh, power cell cutscene kind of things. <laughs> Uh, so, oh, okay, I'm seeing what these symbols are now. So the the key is the main thing that we're trying to get. Then I think the yellow is if you get all of those bottles. And then red is probably like a time trial. So if you make it through the level, like, super duper quick. I see. It's very Crash Bandicoot-esque. Uh, okay, let's grab our extra life from this window. And head on in here. We only need to get one more key, so we should be able to get that. Jackpot, Sly! Look at all this stuff! Must be worth millions! And you know what that means, tighter security. You're gonna have to be extra sneaky to get the treasure key here. Extra sneaky, huh? Okay. I can be sneaky. I feel like one of these things... Oh my goodness, is that the Mona <laughs> It's like a Mona Lisa thing, but it has like a really meme face on it. That's gold. Oh my goodness. I love it. Is it supposed to be like a frog? Because it looked a lot like Pepe. Also, it's how art would come out if I tried to make like something like that. Uh, I completely disregard the fact that if we got hit by it, uh, it would change. I thought we'd just die instantly, but apparently not in this case. Oh, so close. Oh, we made it. Okay, good. Oh, here's the vault. Dude, this is the vault, but you need more clues. Hmm. Well, we see there's a ton of clues up here. Can we get onto like the top of this section too? We can't seem to really pull ourselves up either, even though we have this fancy cane. Hmm. Oh wait, there we go. There we go. We're trying our best to get as many of the things as we can. Maybe one of the levels will get it. A little trickier when they put these gopher beaver walrus creature things in our uh, in our way. <laughs> oh no. Okay, I don't think he can reach us over here, but I'm gonna go over here and get this. Okay, getting the extra life was not worth it. <laughs> I was thinking, get the extra life, since these guys can't really move past this point. We'll get the extra life and we'll be fine. But no, we were not fine. Luckily, they actually have to like hit us in order to hurt us there, so I think if they don't, if they land on us, obviously we're going to get hurt, but if they don't land on us, 
us, then I think we're okay. Uh, how are we supposed to get these other things? Oh, he can jump over onto the section. Okay, we're going to go back for this then. Grab this. Yoink, yoink. Head back. Oh, there's the key up there. I didn't even see that the first few times. Oh, no. He can't swim. Ooh, they put a, the life there each time. So if we get that life every single time, we should be okay. Unless that happens. Hey, guys. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, we're, we can kind of dance on top of the water molecules, I guess. Oh, jeez. How did we manage to do all that? I don't know. Don't question it. We made it. <laughs> that was, uh... That was next level. And there's a checkpoint here. Thank you, game. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate you. I didn't realize there was, uh lights right there. I didn't see the lights. I was just kind of doing my own thing. I was wondering why they had these uh, pillars here. So in this case, you gotta use it to get around here. The lights are so delicate and light. Like, they're not as strong as the other lights that we've seen. Oh, every 100 coins gives us an extra horseshoe. Okay, so coins do have a purpose. Well, we got hit by it anyway. Might as well, might as well grab the other one. Shush. I keep forgetting that we have to hold it down too to go around these things. Okay, well that wasn't too bad. He says after dying 500 times. Back to the main hub. The art style for the cutscenes too is very nice. I love it. Oh, it's a little angler fish. Look at that. Okay, so we should have enough keys to go in here. Sly, see that machine wheel? If my knowledge of mechanical engineering serves me right, applying significant rotational torque to achieve maximum velocity will yield a positive result. You mean something good might happen if I can get the wheel to spin fast enough? Isn't that what I just said? <laughs> oh, good. The writing's good. The writing's so funny. Okay, so we go up here like this. Oh no, we have to. Oh, there is a third key section that we have to get. Oh no, we didn't get all three keys. Temperature's reading way off the charts in here. This must be the power source for the storm machine. So levels aren't really that long, it seems. They're just difficult. So that's not too bad. Okay, we're good. I will figure out these walruses with hammers eventually. Still getting many like OG Crash Bandicoot vibes from this, except instead of being a uh... oh, what is what is Crash again? I forget what he's called. He's a he's not a mutant. He's, uh, he's, hmm, I forget what he's called. He's an orange thing. <laughs> Instead of being that, we are uh, a raccoon. Man, that's going to bother me now. What is, <laughs> I was like, I say it out loud, maybe the Google in my brain will figure it out. I don't know why I tried to jump over that. So maybe we have to run on this thing. Ah, uh, okay. So get it moving, then Grab hold. What a cool mechanic for a game. Who thought of that? These are the creators that made 
Uh, I think the Infamous games made this before they made the Infamous stuff. And I've played a few of those, I think. I've played like the second one or first one a lot. Um, and then the other one only a little bit. I don't remember too much from those those stories. I just remember that uh, they were a lot of fun. And you could choose to be evil, either good or evil. As all my words get mashed together. Is that what we're doing in this case? Are we the good guys that are bad? Or they put us on that side? I don't know. I thought they may, might have been making us out to be like the bad guy. Like we're the anti-hero. Maybe not though. Maybe we are the good guys. We should be the good guys at least. He doesn't seem like he's that evil of a person. He's got a very soft, uh, chill voice vibe going to him. Oh my goodness, Mr. Hammer Boy. I didn't realize we got. We, <laughs> I thought we died completely, so I just stood there. I'm like, oh, okay, I'll wait until I respawn. Okay, this time we know we have the horseshoe because they give it to you beforehand. So they expect you to be bad. Maybe. Okay, we're missing the bottles. We're skipping the bottles. It's already too challenging to get every single bottle. Should have got it just in that first level. Uh, okay, we just gotta run on this thing. Sorry, there's a light running on or going on to me as I'm trying to get it moving. Um, okay. Puzzle, puzzle, puzzle. How are we gonna do this? Maybe we have to get hit by the light. Does that make sense? Ah. Okay, so you want to get hit? I'm a little confused, but okay. Just keep running. Watch out for these other lights. If they see us, then they will laser beam us and kill us instantly. And then we got the key, okay. <laughs> um, sure, sure, we'll take it. Slowly figuring into the game out, slowly getting there. All right, well, I think uh, we're gonna leave this episode there. In the next episode, we're gonna go into that electrical too. Probably have a boss fight, the first one of the game, and uh, it should be a good time. But I wanna thank you guys very much for watching this episode of Sly Cooper. And I hope you have a great rest of your day. Goodbye for now, my friends.